So here we are in California, checking out this sexy bit of kit. It's the Indian FDR 1200. So the FGR 1200 is a completely new genre for Indian motorcycles and it's been based around their FDR 750 flat tracker um, which has been pretty much unrivaled in the American flat track scene. So what they've done, they've made a flat track style bike for the road and uh, this is it, the new FTR 1200. As you can imagine by the name, based around a 1200cc uh, V-twin power plant, um, and it really is unlike any other um, American V-twin that um, that you will have experienced before. Super smooth, um, lots of power, 120, 123 horsepower, 120 newton meters of torque, uh, and this thing really does go like a cut cat. Uh, styling, as I say, based very closely around the flat track bike and it, it really is uh, something very unique. Uh, they even um, got Dunlop to make special road tyres that are designed to look like the rubber you'll see on a flat track bike. Uh, and we've been here hooning around the roads and the canyons uh, and despite their sort of off-road look, um, they're actually surprisingly capable on the road. Now Indian have decided to give the uh, FTR 1200 the full suite of electronics so uh, if you get the S model it begins with uh, the TFT screen which is beautiful to use. It's a touch screen so you can swipe with your gloves um, but there's also the options with um, buttons on the bars and what have you to go through the different menus. You can connect your phone to it, you can change your power modes between um, rain, road and sport. Um, rain cuts power down to 93 horsepower, road and sport uh, you get the full Monty 123 horsepower um, but it just changes the throttle response. You've got traction control, wheelie control, uh, anti-lock brakes. Now these are all switchable as well so you can turn the anti-lock brakes off, it also turns the traction control and the wheelie control off. It would be nice if they were um, independently switchable um, but yep one switch does the whole lot. road and this bike really is a peach. Brembo brakes are fantastic, they're not too sharp uh, which is nice but loads of feel very very progressive. Um, the power is astounding uh, and, and these twisty roads you can stay in third gear, you can let the revs drop to almost 2000 rpm and the bike will pull, pull smoothly out of the corners uh, and just accelerates hard all the way up to the 9000 rpm red line. to tackle a few more canyons, do a few more Ks, um, but from us here at Bike Rider Magazine, this Indian FTR 1200 certainly gets the thumbs up. <laughs>